So up next is Express Cells. Express Cells is a genetic editing biotech that creates custom and catalog cell lines for biological research using CRISPR and their patented fast HDR system. Please welcome Matt Handel, founder and CEO of Express Cells. Well, thank you very much and hello everyone. Um, as you heard, we're a biotechnology company doing genetic engineering, but we're a little bit different. We're already revenue generating because we don't focus on therapeutics nor on diagnostics. We create cell lines that are used by researchers. In other words, we're helping the people who are trying to get the next best therapeutic or diagnostic. Now, what's a cell line? There are cells that are grown outside of an organism, mouse cells, human cells, you know, uh, yeast cells are all used in the laboratory because before you can do research in people or in animals, you need to do them in cells. Now, genetic engineering, like what we do, makes cells useful. Here's a picture of what cells look like under a normal microscope. A little hard to discern what's going on. We can change them so that the cells fit the scientific experiment rather than the other way around. Our particular segment, knock-ins, where we insert genes, is a pretty unsatisfied market. It takes forever, it seems, to deliver cell lines, especially if you have a high burn rate at your small company. You can only do a limited number of insertions, and even worse, genes may go to the wrong location. In other words, it could be garbage in, garbage out. We have a better way. Uh, we're a CRISPR company. We use CRISPR to create a uh, break or an injury in the genome, and then we trick the cell zone repair mechanism into inserting our plasmid, our free-floating bit of DNA, for us. The result is that we can knock in multiple genes into a cell and make it look very different. Look at the cells down below. Uh, actually, the same type of cells that I showed in the last slide, but now we've knocked in genes that code for three different fluorescent proteins. Very easy for the scientists to see what's going on or overexpress their target. Now, cell lines is a huge and quickly growing market. CRISPR cell lines alone are 1.6 billion in uh, 2020, growing to over 6 billion in 2028. Um, cell line engineering, which is what we do, is the largest segment. It's over 500 million. Um, probably last year, and over 600 million this year. We've gotten great traction since we launched in uh, 2018. We have 35 customers. Uh, we got our first U.S. patent uh, last year in January. We have both U.S. and other patents in negotiation. We have uh, catalog items, although most of our business comes from custom work. We have a Japanese distribution agreement already producing sales, and we're so busy we're opening a larger facility in April of 2022. Now, I said we have customers. You can see uh, we have a wide variety of customers, some big names like Genentech and Biogen, a lot of smaller companies. Some of you may have invested in them and some leading academic institutions as well. And who's doing this? Well, we have a very well uh, organized and uh, skilled team. Um, one thing to note, all five of us have been with the company for over two and a half years. We have a nice stable management team. And as you can see, we have people who are former CEOs, people who have deep expertise in genetic engineering. Our business model is straightforward. We do everything in our own laboratory to control quality. We have multi-channel promotion online, in person when available, as well as a fair amount of work that we're now doing through distributors and we continue to talk to potential partners. We're delivering significant uh, margins, 80% plus. And if you look, we have a 30 million revenue target in 2026. You can see how this grows. Uh, we have a number of different factors driving it, our current business, international, expanding the product line to include other types of cells that researchers need, and a royalty-based business based on cells that are used in manufacturing. Finally, how do you get involved? We have the Series B going on right now. It's $3 million. It's a priced round. We're 50% committed, so plenty of space. It's preferred equity. Uh, uh, Perry Passu, for the most part, with our Series A, and our pre-money valuation is 10 million. Um, it's our last raise before profitability and hopefully a potential exit. And what we're targeting right now is hopefully a 10 to 14 times return based on comparables. So we're Express Cells, a commercial genetic engineering company. If you'd like to get involved in biotech, but in a company that's already producing revenue, join us in the breakout room. 